second match of the afternoon, second match of the day, involving true democracy in yellow and blue, taking on their opponent, New Town Youth, in the orange and white. After the toss and the pleasantries, both coaches, Ricky Yamua and his opposite number, Bernard Tay, embraced each other and the game got underway with New Town FC playing from right to left, showing glimpses of what their intentions were earlier on in the game. Captain Bernard Kofi has been taking a lot of the uh, set pieces, especially the corner kicks, but to no avail. We've also had a couple of shots, either blocked by goalkeeper or off target. But it's not being one-way traffic. True Democracy also had their opportunities, but look at the unique qualities of goalkeeper Olivier Gagou, who reacted positively to that. Apart from that, there have been careful runs in there with culprits, the likes of Sumaila Asamoah for Newtown Youth, trying to create space for themselves. Kwesi Mensah has been, or has played a pivotal role in the build-up for true democracy, especially down the right-hand side of attack. And again, one of those shots that kept flying high, flying high and high. That was from Captain Zama Mazouk. But all said and done, chances were created. Set pieces were won, but all to no avail. Careful defending on both sides. With Newtown FC running against the defenders, but again, lacking the power and the precision to finish moves off. And uh, when it was noticeable that the free kicks and the set pieces were not being taken advantage of, it was more of an all-play-all situation. Player taking a dive in the 18-yard box. Niakwa noticed it and rightly gave him the card and then ruled this one as a no penalty and that is where the fans showed their displeasure by roaring against the, the uh, referee. This tells you how tough the game has been with almost all the set pieces being dealt with or wasted. It was clearly evident that the half would come to an end with no team. All right, viewers, so thanks for joining us once again for the second half of this match by Ankara. Goes round his marker, not makes him in the process. Into the 18 yard box, he's clear from behind. I see who will come out of this corner kick, swinging nicely towards the 18 yard box. Goalkeeper goes out, get his fist to it. But the clearance was not the best. Oh. Clearly had his eye on tag. Into the 18 yard box. A quick dummy. Oh! It should have been just an easy tap from Charles Mensah. He decided to go for power. Outside into the 18 yard box, a quick and eventually goalkeeper stands alert. It's a clearance by the youth from uh, Newtown. Player goes down in the process. Oh, cannons of the goalkeeper's chest. Can That's a hassle for the ball. He manages to turn and get in the cross, but it's blocked on its way. True Democracy still have more. It's a hassle for the ball. He manages to turn and get in the cross, but it's blocked on its way. True Democracy still have more. We'll walk through the replay again. Good play there, and then the shot came through. The defender was only doing his job, trying to defend. But rather clicked Gunnar's shot. Goalkeeper had it covered. Where was the communication between defender and goalkeeper? Gona took advantage of the shots. 
defender went in to try and stop the ball. He ended up scoring. As Newton youth come forward, there's an opportunity to strike on target. Ankara sends in the cross. First header from behind. He tries to control his balance. He does. He sets up the pass. Yes, Ayi. There's nobody there going for Ayi. Ayi brings it back and eventually the ball is taken away from him. Involved with most of the situations. But now it's an opportunity for Jacob Kujoji to come forward. He lays on the pass. He goes through the middle. This should be obvious. Oh! The goal post again and again. It's another goal for true democracy. It's done to show your colors, to show your support. Goal post prevented the first effort, but not the second from Samuel Gona. Goalkeeper completely beaten, but saved by the woodwork, but not this time, says Samuel Gona. Picking his spot. Referee blows the whistle. He's drilled. Coach, congratulations. Thank you. You stood by your name, you lived by your name, true democracy. But sure. first of all, like I asked your colleague, how tough was this match? Actually, from our first game, I said it, that when we get there, you know how to cross the bridge. So we were prepared for this game. Was it a game that you knew that it was going to come easy? or you felt some difficulty, some strong opposition from Newtown Youth? Actually, this morning, I was called by your own station, and I told them they were saying it would be difficult, but I said, when we get there, we will surely go through. So we've done it. So you surely got there, you surely went through. What's the next step? We are going to plan for our final game. So when we get there, as I said, we we'll cross the bridge. Generally, would you say this competition has brought the best out of your team? Or you think there's more to expect? It's okay for now, but still I think we can do better. You can do better. That's it. True democracy, you think they deserve to be the overall winners? This year, that is our target, okay. that we want to get to, the, to Division 1. Mm -hmm. So sure, we are going to Division 1. We wish you the very best in the final. Thank you. Thank so you very much. much. Welcome. Thank you.